my friends and welcome back to another video. Today we're doing a organization sort of video. As you know, I have had this big bookshelf in the background of my videos for the last, I don't know, almost a year now or something like that. I don't even, I don't even know how long I've had this. But this has been my sole bookshelf for as long as I've had it. I had this little pitiful, like, it wasn't really a bookshelf. I mean, I guess it was kind of a bookshelf, but it was like a really weird, stacky thing. Whatever. It had books on it. And I had that next to it, and it didn't hold a lot because it was kind of small. And so I've been desperately needing a new bookshelf because I have just piles and piles and piles and piles and piles of books all around the room because I don't have anywhere to put them. <laughs> and so for my birthday, my mom actually got me this coffin bookshelf, which I am literally in love with. I think it is absolutely so cool and it fits my aesthetic. It fits my vibe. I am going to put some of the piles and piles and piles of books that I have on it. Also, I am going to reorganize this one behind me a little bit because I know not all of the books that I um, have in piles are going to fit on this because it is kind of, I mean, it's a, it's a coffin shape, so it gets a little narrow, so it's not like the same, you know, width all the way. So it doesn't hold as much as this one does, but I've started unhauling some books. Um, I'm not going to show you them in this video, but I am going to do a separate video where I show you the books that I'm unhauling. Um, so I won't talk about them. In this video so if you see me like taking books off or you see books disappearing from this shelf that's just gonna be in a different video. So I have a plan because I have stacks of books right here next to me um, which you can't really see <laughs> because of the height uh, to show you the bookshelf but um, I have basically organized them into piles of hardcover horror, hardcover thriller, paperback horror, paperback thriller. I have a bunch of Junji Ito that I'm going to uh, put with the rest of my Junji Ito. And then I have um, my book of the month books that I'm also going to put on this shelf. I'm going to reorganize it a bit over here, but that has nothing to do with this shelf. So with this shelf, as you can see, I already have some books on it. And that's because, you know, I had to give my Darcy collection a home. And I really, really wanted it to be on the coffin bookshelf just because, I, I don't know, I just think it's going to look really cool. So, unfortunately, they all don't fit together. <laughs> I even tried them on this shelf right here and they all don't fit. Um, so I split these up. So these are like my favorites up here and then these are the rest that... I also like and enjoy, but they're not my absolute top favorites. So that's how I pretty much organize them. And so where I'm going to go from here is, um, I'm kind of winging it, but I'm also not. Like I kind of planned it out from yesterday when I was setting everything up for this video. But, um, yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to kind of just try to fit as many books as I can on here and hope for the best. Um, yeah, that's pretty much, that's pretty much what I'm doing at this point. I'm just hoping for the best. I'm just really trying to get everything into a spot so I don't have piles of books on my floor, um, which will event inevitably start happening again because I, I mean, these are going to get full and I'm just not going to have any room. So, uh, it's just a cycle, a never-ending cycle, but the goal is to get as many books on these two shelves today as possible from these stacks, which I said you can't really see, but I mean, no biggie. It's fine. I'll tell you what I'm doing or at least um, show you what I'm doing as I go. Um, I'll have to move the camera a bit so you can see the rest of this <laughs> bookshelf because it's kind of cut off. So for this section right here, I think what I'm going to do is put some of my favorite hardback horror books like in this spot. So right here I'm gonna try to fit Slewfoot. Um, it's kind of a tight squeeze, I'm not gonna lie to you, um, because Slewfoot is kind of a large book. Um, so I'm gonna just stick it right here 
And then I'm going to put the last house on Needless Street and Cackle and Mexican Gothic. And we're also going to stick Cherish Pharaoh right here and White Smoke. Um, I think that looks pretty good. I mean, like, honestly, I'm not going for any, like, real <laughs> cohesion, to be honest. Um, I don't really know exactly what I'm doing. I'm just trying to get as many books as I can to fit. So, for right now, this is fine. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I guess we're gonna move on to the next shelf. I'm gonna have to move the camera, so hold tight. Okay, so next for this shelf, I'm going to take, I think, I don't know. See, I feel like this is a lot of trial and error, but I'm gonna take some of my hardcover uh, thrillers. This is The Night Shift and these Silent Woods, and I'm gonna kind of like just kind of stack them here like this um maybe <laughs> i don't know if i actually have a plan to be honest i thought i had a plan um but i don't really know okay change of plans everyone change of plans i'm gonna move oops i'm gonna move these to this side ah! oh my gosh change of plans i'm gonna move these to this side and i'm gonna recreate Exact okay, this is just disrespectful that they're falling around everywhere. Okay, I'm gonna put these here And Then I'm gonna take some paperback horror and put them Sideways, so we're gonna recreate What we did up here, but like opposites, you know, so then I'm gonna take this like so Okay, we definitely have room for more of the books over here. Okay, adding some more to this stack right here. Oh, this is uneven, it's fine. We're fine, we're fine with it, we're fine with it. Gonna add another one here. Okay, I'm gonna leave this as is for right now. I know that there's more space, but I just kinda wanna see what's where everything is. But we're gonna move down to the next uh level because i have more <laughs> books so let me do that real quick okay for this shelf i honestly don't remember how i was going to have it like i'm gonna be completely honest i really don't remember but i'm gonna do something here so i have an idea so i have these hard covers they are Sundial, Comfort Me with Apples, and Nothing But Blackened Teeth. And I'm going to put that here. And then I'm going to put another stack, you guessed it, okay, like this, up and down. Because I think this is how they're all going to fit. Like, I really, truly believe the only way I'm going to get these all on here <laughs> is by doing this. So we're going to put books here like this do, do, do. these are all like paperback thrillers that I have right here like that um, I could fit a few more I think right here on top so maybe like this one and um Maybe this one, I don't know. Like honestly, oops, that's uneven. Like that. Honestly, I'm not really sure. I'm just kind of like going with the vibe as of now, because I really don't know what I'm doing. Like, I don't know how I want all of these. So, um, yeah, that's, that's, that's the vibe as of right now. <laughs> so, let's move on to the last a uh, little space down here. I'm gonna move you down again so you can see and I already know what I'm doing with This little shelf so that'll be easy, but let me let me bring you down there. Okay, so for this space I'm going to just put my 
uh, erased manga here because I want them in a shelf where they belong because they're perfect. So I'm just gonna put the whole series in this little little pocket. It's gonna be its own little erased shelf. How cute. Oh, beautiful. There. So that's how that's gonna go. I love it. We still have some books. <laughs> But I think I'm going to move on to the uh, big shelf over here and um, do some reorganizing because, yeah, that's what I'm going to need to do before I finish up this, this little guy over here. So let me move you again <laughs> so you can see this big shelf. Okay, so... For here, this is where I had some of my Darcy's before, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to move some of these and I'm going to put my book of the month books that I've read up here. So let me just take these down. Okay, so now my book of the months are here. Um, they're taking up a lot more space than I anticipated. <laughs> so that's great, um, but I'm gonna move some of these now too and make room for stuff. So next over here, I'm going to put some books this way um and leave some space hopefully because i have an idea for this that's gonna affect the next shelf we'll see hold on i don't know Okay, so what I did is I brought my Anya Alborns back up here and I moved Blood on the Tracks by Shuzo Oshimi. Um, the eighth one doesn't really fit, so it's on top. Um, but I moved it up here because I need to make room on the next shelf for all my Junji, um, which we're going to do now. Okay, so I'm gonna move Flowers of Evil down here. Um, I'm hoping this is gonna make enough room for all my Junji. I really friggin hope so. I have the special edition cat diary um, by Junji Ito that I'm going to put back here because it's big and it takes up space. I also have this Twisted Visions um, art uh, book that I'm going to put back here because it's very large. So I'm going to stick that back here. And then, oh gosh. This is not going to make as much room as I anticipated. <laughs> no! What do I do? The unfortunate part is um, this is how many Junjis I have to fit. And this is the space <laughs> I have allowed myself, <laughs> apparently. So I don't know what to do. I don't know if I should just pick and choose some and find places for others. Ugh, but I don't want to split them up. I don't want Junji to be so separated. Oh wait, this isn't Junji. This was in the different pile. That's all I have space for. <laughs> this is all I have space for and I still have these. What is a girl to do? 
What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? So either, I mean like I could do this. <laughs> I feel like it kind of looks dumb, but at the same time, I don't have space. So, like, I don't know. That doesn't even leave, oh my gosh. I don't even have space for all of them. So one of them is gonna get left out. Look, look, can I just fit this in here? Oh my God, I can. Oh my God, I just made that work. How, how did I make that work? I don't know. <sighs> okay, does it look the nicest? No. Also, I kinda wanna scoot this all the way over like this, but it's stuck. Wait, there we go, okay. Kinda wanna scoot this all the way over so it lines up. Look, does it look great? Probably not, but did I get them all in this shelf? Yes. Is that all that matters to me? Yes. So I'm gonna just leave it as is for right now. I don't know what else to do. Um, this is kind of just like a manga shelf and I wanna leave it like that. And I already moved blood on the tracks from up down here to up here. So like, I don't know what else I'm supposed to do about this, but that's, <laughs> that's these two shelves, I think, for right now. <laughs> the next shelf, I'm honestly not gonna do much to because I like the way it is. So um, I'll show you because I do have to add a, add a book to it, but other than that, there's not much going to be changed. So let me lower you down. The only thing I'm doing to this row is adding an R.L. Stein to the pile. This is Silent Night, and I'm just gonna put it up here, I know it's uneven. Look, I don't care. I just need it to be in here, okay? That's all I need is it to be in the stack. That's all I need. So this is what's happening. I think I'm gonna add more thriller books to this pile because otherwise I don't really have any other room. That's what we're doing right this second. It's just gonna add some thrillers to this stack. Look, okay. I understand, but I just, there's there's nowhere else to put these, okay? There's nowhere else to put them. There's literally nowhere else to put them, okay? I'm trying my best. My best is not good enough. Okay, so there's that. I just added one, two, three, four, four books to the pile. Okay, so some of my book of the months were back here. I'm gonna just push these all the way back and then um, oh, I should probably put this with the hardcovers too okay so then we have this to work with I'm gonna add Frankenstein to this pile too hopefully and then I guess I'm just gonna shove some books I don't have that much space, <laughs> look, okay? I don't have that much space. I'm realizing it, I'm realizing it, it's great. I'm realizing that I'm gonna be out of space still. No matter how hard I try, I'm gonna be out of space. And there it is. There's not, there's no space left, okay. I really, I really overestimated how many books I could fit, didn't I? Okay, so I have some more books to add to this pile. 
I know that this is going to be mixing hardback and paperback, but honestly, I just have too many books to care right now to try to get on here. So, I'm going to put Krampus on top of Slewfoot because they're basically the same size. If I can even lift this stack, please don't come for me for paperback and hardcovers mixing. I can't handle it because I just have to get these on here. So, no one come for me. I'm sorry. Okay, like I'm sorry, but this is going to have to be what it's going to have to be, okay? So I'm going to put Horrid up here too, like that, beautiful, wonderful, amazing, it looks great, yep, don't tell me otherwise because I will be angry, thank you. That looks great, sure. I mean, honestly, does it look good? I don't really care at this point. Honestly, I have two books left to fit on here. This one's too big. <laughs> Maybe I'll just put it right here on top of white smoke. I did it, I did it. Okay, great. So, I'm going to give you an up close little thing of both bookshelves real quick and then um I'll decorate it I'm probably gonna do it off camera no offense I'm so sorry guys but like honestly this is a lot and I don't even know what I'm doing so Okay, I did it. I got all the books I needed to and wanted to on both bookshelves. Does it look perfect? Does it look super nice and aesthetic? Probably not, but honestly, I just needed these books off the floor that I will take the haphazard way they look right now over just having books laying about everywhere. I was going to decorate on camera with you all, but honestly I'm exhausted and I have to film another video after this showing you my unhaul. So um, you'll probably see the decorations in the other video, not this one. So I'm really sorry. <laughs> it's the same decorations. I'm not adding anything new to the, the mix. It's just going to be dispersed from this shelf to this shelf and you know, that kind of thing. So yeah, um, I guess that's the end of the video. I hope this was somewhat entertaining or cool or interesting or something. I don't really know because I'm not going to know until I edit it. And even then, I probably won't even know if I like it. So, 
If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. It lets me know what kind of content you enjoy from me. That way I can keep providing you with that kind of content. Feel free to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. We can become friends, talk about books. Obviously, I got lots, got lots of them. Oh. Uh, spooky things, manga, horror, thrillers, yada yada yada, all that jazz. I hope you are having a wonderful day, night, morning, afternoon, wherever you are, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!